Let me introduce our new training summary analytics. Let's start with the team training summary view. Here, I'll be shown all the athletes who have logged data today. But I haven't had anybody train today, so let's go ahead and look at yesterday. Now, I'm shown all the reps and volume that my athletes achieved, as well as the duration and self-reported intensity of the session. So if I filtered by team, for example, you could look and see how hard your athletes thought the session was that day. Let's look at a couple things here. So Lindsay had a body weight session and didn't have any lift volume to log, so she has no value there. Adam, that's me, forgot to log his intensity, so I might have to get on him about that. Let's say we want to look at one athlete a little bit more in depth, so I'm actually curious about how Donnie's training is going. That brings up the last 30 days of what he's logged. There are some interesting things you can figure out here. So he started doing more volume, he was doing pretty high volume sessions here, but his session time I noticed didn't really slide up and his intensity started climbing. Additionally, his weights weren't really going up as I expected them to. So we kind of reconfigured his training slightly and you can see that he's doing fewer reps and a little bit less volume in a little more time. And accordingly, his intensity has slid down. So I want him to lift heavier. So I set my expectation for him that he would rest a little longer between sets. He's doing fewer exercises, higher specificity, and lifting heavier weights. This is verification that my plan for him is actually playing out in real life how I expect it to.